just a whole family. That's when you know that what we are doing is just keeping off. <laughs> just us and the mountain goats. You are hiding the mountains, thinking in the best way to descend. The obvious answer might be go downhill, right? Yet, during our inspiring hike in Montserrat, we found ourselves defying the obvious. We climbed higher and higher before even considering our descent. Along the way, we encourage vintage vertical steps, emerging with character, unexpected rocky paths, very sketchy cliff, risk, and even some wild animals. All before civilization came back into view. What's an adventure without a few unforeseen surprises? The tours and extra kilometers, right? We hike from Manresa to the monastery of Montserrat on day one. Explore the hiking trails and tourist hotspots around the monastery on day two and recharge our batteries to face the grand finale of our adventure on day three. From the monastery of Montserrat to Igualada. Welcome! This is the final part. To be honest, this day felt like navigating the unknown. Settle into your seat as we break a sweat ascending. I mean descending and dreaming for the comfort you are currently enjoying. Are you ready? Now we are ready for our last last day. Last day of hiking. We're going over there. We're going over there. Buenos dias, Sebastián. Buenos dias. Are we on the correct route? No, we're not. So, where no, should we go? No, we're on the correct route. Climbing the stairs? Uh-huh. The only of the day. Amazing! Mm -hmm. This is the sign we are gonna follow most of the yes. way, right? Yes. Excellent. For like 10 kilometers. Woohoo! We follow the red and the white. Let's go! I don't like stairs. <laughs> I hate stairs. With I'm a, passion. How many minutes into the trip are we? Two. <laughs> 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 yeah. We start with a little bit of a climb. I think it was two, 250, 300 meters. Only stairs. Stairs. Well, and this non-stair thing. Well, but this is beautiful. There it is. More stairs. More stairs. Right. Yeah. So we were talking. <laughs> I I found these stairs behind the monastery yesterday. That looked very nice on the map. Very short. And then we get to the top. And uh, and I was trying to figure out where to find the stairs, and then <laughs> Kaluvi started googling for these stairs. <laughs> How do these stairs look? And uh, yeah, then we decided not to take those stairs. How do they look, Amor? Like this. <laughs> but what we are doing is like this. It's not too much a difference. <laughs> it's a lot of difference. The stairs. It looked like there was a lot of ladders involved in the stairs. Met like metallic ladders that looked very dodgy. <laughs> Not completely Climbing straight. Into the abyss. <laughs> <laughs> With some stair ridges and uh, all kinds of fun adventures. And uh, yeah, maybe, maybe for another day. But not this day. Almost out of sight of the monastery already. <laughs> ah, it's getting narrower. Yeah, it's a beautiful place to build a monastery. Ambitious. I found these stairs very cute. <laughs> Going up between the stones. Generally, they just got rid of the handrails now. We're a bit in the forest. Still with some drops, but we're getting closer to the top. Right, look at this. Okay. 
Ah, so cute. Very cute. <laughs> Hello down there. I think these stairs are they're steeper than they probably look on camera. For my shorter legs. This is this is straight for me. Kalu is my doing Latina short legs. You're doing a heroic job with your Latina legs. <laughs> they are short but very strong. Yes. Yay. Ah, you made it. We're almost there. And then we go into the forest and we start going down again. You can see the top of the trees. And we have a red and white friend. I will be following us for a third of the hike today. I think we might have the top here. Nope. 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 Almost up. <laughs> 895. Okay, well, that means we are very close to the top. And from here to Montserrat, it has, takes secret hours 20 minutes. <laughs> Santa Cecilia, 1 hour 35 minutes. That's where we're going. The time for that we have set for ourselves is to be at Santa Cecilia before 12. Otherwise we will go more on the road instead. We're going up. Because of my excellent map reading or lack of map reading, we have gone the wrong way. Ah, so we need to go back. Mm -hmm. We went maybe 100 meters. Yeah. Far Too far and up yeah. a few stairs. And actually this sign that we were reading, this arrow is pointing this way. And if we see this which is the sign that we were looking actually for. Here, up to this, because this is the where we came from. This is where we went. And this but is where we are going. We need to go <laughs> up here. <laughs> okay. Uh, that was not obvious. I hope the path will be more prepared than this. To the forest. Look at the clouds. Yeah. We actually have clouds today. And hopefully they will be going away. We'll see. Oh, there's like a viewing spot here. Yes. You can see. Mirador. And the clocks are ringing. It's 10 o'clock. And we have met quite a lot of people on the way actually yes all of them going down well it was the elderly couple of people that were going up people seem to be taking the funicular up and then walking down we are not those people <laughs> <laughs> yesterday we did the opposite we, did we the opposite. walked up and took the funicular down right on we go um i guess it's yeah. this way let's check the map okay we are very very close to the top now we have Come one and a half kilometers in one hour and fifteen minutes. <laughs> which are we doesn't... lazy? No, we are not lazy. We're very steep. It doesn't sound great exactly, but I think we have climbed 250, 300 meters, something. Did I say I hate stairs? And more, I thought you enjoyed stairs. Since we met almost almost four years. Go. I have heard Kaluvi's love for stairs. There is a love story there. I'm very active. Yeah, very active, hiking, everything. 
but the stairs. <laughs> maybe do you think this is the top I don't know maybe we have the red and white uh, we are out of the stairs for now there. ah we'll it's encouraging us to keep going to avoid the stairs we're going up into the into the heavens. That's where we're going. Let's check the map. <sighs> no, but we have the red and white. Okay, okay. It's perfect. If we get lost, you will carry me on your shoulders. <laughs> Every, any day, Amor. Any day. Uh, okay, wow. okay. Let's let's check the map. Just to be safe. Yeah. And of course, my beautiful wife was correct again. This is the route we need to take. Which I discovered after I checked the map. This time we only went like 10 meters too far. This video will just be a lot of stonking and moaning. <laughs> I'm very sorry about that. Yeah. And this 172, GR, GR 172 is the one we're following. So it points this way. We go this way. So here we have a view, Amar. And then you walk away from me. Look at this view here. <laughs> and then we have this view. Beautiful. What? We forgot this view. Ah, this view. Exacto. <laughs> Amazing view. The view of the cameraman. Cameraman. Oh, yes. Excellent. Going through the gates of heaven. This gate looks a bit closed. Also, it looks like it's a bit uh, roundable. Uh, maybe we cannot actually go through the gates of heaven. Oh, maybe we can. Maybe we can. Woo. Oh, yeah. Wow. Look at that. Close the door be behind you. Yes, especially to the gates of heaven. Oh, Have to yeah. be careful about who we let in. Yes, exactly. <laughs> We were fresh and happy, a bit naive also, to think that those stairs were the main challenge of the day. The day was just getting interesting. And I think from this point on it's mostly downwards actually in the rest of the day, which will be quite pleasant. <laughs> Very nice. So, bye bye. Monastery, bye bye, clouds. Welcome, city. Checking yeah. temperature Celia, 5.7, and we have done 1.9, so that means it's four kilometers to go. My math is completely broken. Hi. Out of the forest, well, forest, forestry part, and then we're out on a cliffside, and then back into the forestry part, kind of, kind of like that. But if you see, it's this is this is horizontal, and the ground is down there. It's difficult to show it on film. Also, up and up and up. So it's quite, quite steep. It just looks very dodgy. Well, no really. Be careful, huh? But here it seems quite easy. I took another route. Just here and then I held myself with the branches. Whew. But my amazing... Mountain goat. <laughs> Mountain goat. Ah. My amazing husband. <laughs> who has careful as a second name <laughs> decide to go <laughs> from this way
he's there. This is the sign. We found it. This is the sign. We are making progress. We are closing in on Santa Cecilia. Yes. The you can kind of see the road down there. And... Oh. Mírala, aquí. What? <laughs> Where is the camera? I don't know. What is in there? <laughs> Terrible! Let's see, what are you looking at? Oh, we have Santa Cecilia over there. Ah. And here we have a steep, steep, steep drop down to the road. But we're getting closer. We're kind of meeting up with the road. The road is going up and we're going down. We are quite close to Santa Cecilia now. We will, we will take a break. And think about our plans for the afternoon if we will continue on this trail or if we will go on the road to pick up the pace it's almost 12 now and we have 24 kilometers to go so this way is the way we came from five kilometers to monster and this way this way is another five kilometers yes to where we will meet with the road and then in front of us is the path down to Santa Cecilia. Exactly. And uh, now we will make a decision. I think we kind of made a decision to keep going already. Maybe, but, uh, yes. Let's have some food and think about it. So we decided to go on with the trail. Which so side? We are going that way, actually. Over this there? The sign. That's where we are going. That's where we're going. Yeah. And the time is. 12.04 This path is very very nice Very bushy Beautiful This is where we came from This is where we're going And off to the side we have a cliff Okay, this is a bit uh, sketchy. Um, we don't want to go down there. <laughs> All right. I will. Uh, I wish I had a GoPro. A GoPro would be very nice. That will definitely be a future investment. Uh, but for now, I will use both my hands to get past this. I'm sorry. Well, you because you have long legs, huh? Yeah, makes things easier. Yeah. I managed to poke a, a stick through my uh, <laughs> through my bloody hand. Yeah, there is a mysterious tunnel up there. We are unfortunately not going there, but that looks very interesting. We are we came from there. We made it, and now we're going in there, following the path. There is another path going up here also. Very interesting place. Well. Is there a way to check the status of footpath? Please let us know. As you see, we really need to check that the next time. Perfecto, mi amor. I, I did it. We did it. I cannot imagine how it will be with actual water in the waterfall. Yeah. I don't think it's possible. <laughs> no. That is super, super sketchy. Yeah. So now I think it will be a bit easier for a while. Maybe. Before we start the real climb again. Let's see. <laughs> and here is mi amor. Hola. <laughs> With the sign here and the sign there. We have a sign so we here. Have signs. And there we and are going. Over there. Over there. Mwah. So we actually found another sign. There is one here. And if I turn around, there is one there. And if I turn around, there is another one here. I am in the triangle. I think they do some, some uh, sacrifices. <laughs> <laughs> Some sacrifices for the poor hikers 
that didn't make it through the waterfall. Maybe the hikers were the sacrifice to the waterfall gods. That's my theory. And I'm sticking to it. And now we have one path here. We have another one there. We have a sign here that says go to the right. Okay. And the right is which right? Let's let's check the map. All right. Hola, mi amor. Walking and walking and walking. Now we begin the second big climb of the day. This one without stairs. The views along the mountain were as breathtaking as the effort we were putting to each step in our adventure. But we discovered we were not alone. The whole family. <laughs> That's when you know that what we are doing is a stepping off. <laughs> <laughs> Just us and the mountain goats. Well, some parts of this hike is uh, breathtaking, but doable. A bit, uh, <laughs> a bit scary. It's uh, very steep, very slippery. Uh, yeah, don't bring your kids on this hike, people. So we made six and a half kilometers total now, and it's quarter past one, which means we have been going for 10, 11, 12, so four hours. Six and a half kilometers. Uh, it's going a bit too slow. It's very, very steep drops and to one narrow. side and very narrow and uh, tilting. Uh, so you have to use your hands and kind of slide. Uh, and then other parts is, is quite easy, like this. Um, part of the adventure. Yeah. But just if you walk this path, be prepared for some quite sketchy parts and looks like we're coming up to another one now. Maybe. No, it's not too bad. But we have another waterfall-ish situation. Wow, and look at this. We have the big guys. The big guys up here. And then... Um, yep. Nope. Slip is sliding. Wow. All right, I will stop recording. We are kind of running out of time a bit. It's uh, 1.30 now. So... To save some time. Yes, we are... Uh, we are... Going to the Carretera BP 1103. It's easier to walk. Five minutes. On and then we will highway. walk on the road the last three yeah. kilometers. It's not as uh, nicer, but it's faster. Yeah. We know we, we can keep the, the pace. Yep, we need to keep up the pace, because yeah. uh, sunset is quite early this late in the year. And it's a bit cloudy, it's not so clear as yeah. the last so, day. Unfortunately, but yeah. the hiking continues, we have another 20 kilometers to go. Go! So, now we go down to the road. See you there. What amazing way to conclude this mountain experience that we start in the monastery, that with the stairs. So you start with the stairs? Ah, with the stairs. we have stairs. Amazing. Amazing. Let's try the stairs. 
Are the stairs of good quality? Mm, not so much. Very dubious quality. <laughs> but they, they, they did the job. Now let's keep going, Amor. Yep. Let's go and go. We were now following the St. James Way in Catalonia and we were started to find our way around. And I think we are climbing over again. Oh, and, and we have our first Camino arrow. Now I need to climb over again. Should we go and check it out or? Mm. Maybe shortly. Two minutes. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> the timekeeper is not happy. I'm late, I'm late, I'm late. We have to do all the side quests, right? <laughs> Maybe. Stony things. Very weird. Where does this road go? Someone loves the key. Wow. Oh, sucks to be them. Ah, we're coming back out on the road again. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. <laughs> After such a wonderful walk, we made it through the tunnel. The other side of the wonderful tunnel. Exactly. Because we were taller than 4.5 meters. No. We couldn't go through. No. And now, arrow. Arrow. Oh, we need to cross the road. Yes. Finally, we were approaching the second break of the day. Sí. Mira, kilómetro cero. And we go from this arrow to that arrow over there. Let's do it. We are not doing it. Okay. Are we doing it? We're going this way. Okay. Right, so this is. Masana, Chan Masana, where all the arrows were pointing to the signs. And we decide to make our stop here. Yeah. It's a very cool one. I think this, this one here, this one here looks like the one we planned to take, but we came mm. from, we came from here somewhere, <clears throat> going, and yeah. then we would connect with this one, and then go here. I mm. think that was the plan, if I remember correctly. Yeah. But we bailed somewhere here yeah I don't remember exactly but somewhere over here time for a break yes okay so we had our stop now we need to figure out where to go follow the yellow signs <laughs> I think this is the way in there. Yep, that's where we're going. And we say bye bye to the mountains for this time. See you later. Here we have the Camino arrow. And what do we find here? Our old friend, the red and white. We are following the Camino signs. The Camino sign says go up <laughs> and to the left i don't know i will i will i will cheat and i will take this <laughs> this path on the side here i thought we were going down 
Exactly. This, this is a big lie. And all the arrows are just pointing up. Honestly, we didn't expect to have so many ups in this route. But at least we got some motivation to continue. Look, we have the sun. Yes. Yeah, I think it's the first time today. Yeah. The sun is it's guiding us, is guiding us down from the mountain. It is almost impossible to believe, but finally everything was downhill or flat. We found civilization. Here we have all the signs. Finally, sign for Igualada, Santiago. That's a bit, maybe a bit ambitious for today. What we left behind. Yeah. Do you say more? We got Santiago. Let's do it. <laughs> maybe not today. You have very long arms. Very long arms. Yeah, yes. you should get those too. <laughs> right? <laughs> Amazing. I can try a more. Yeah, try. we should upgrade our technology a bit. Maybe a selfie stick. Maybe. GoPros. I think would be much better. Somewhere in here, we had our last pit stop. I cannot stress enough how important was this last break for us. We were really exhausted. I think we got down here actually. Or no? Yeah, no, it says. Adio privada de caca. De caca. Well, for sure it's not caca. It's casa. <laughs> the charms of our polyglot relationship. Doing it. We are doing it. We are doing it for the pizza. For the pizza. Yes. And the beer. And the beer. And also Eternal Glory. Glory. <laughs> The last 10 kilometers were kind of enjoyable, but our feet and knees were wishing for us to stop. It was a 10 kilometers on an asphalt route with some small towns and even some high intensity activities to offer. Just fell only 700 meters. Oh, we missed the adrenalina paintball. Oh no. Yeah. A once in a lifetime opportunity. <laughs> The loyal Camino de Santiago was our guide until the end. We cannot complain. We found an uh, amazing cagatillo. Very cute. This is cute. Not this, as Sebastian suggested, right? So we are walking and walking and walking. We have just passed the 20 kilometer, which means there is six and something kilometers left. And uh, yeah, the energy levels are getting quite low. <laughs> but we are With we are muddling through. We're You're looking motivated. forward. We're looking forward to the pizza. Yes. Uh, the sun is setting quite soon. Uh. We saw the sunset in front of us. We were literally walking in very deserted roads, which somehow motivated us to think about our day. The sun is very much setting now. Oh. And... Uh, It's quite a beautiful sunset. I'm looking for the, the light. Yeah. Maybe it would be nice to have it now. That sounds like a good idea. We are at 23 kilometers, so we 
we have three and something kilometers left, so not not too much to go now. No. And then the the pizza, the pizza is awaiting us. Hopefully. <laughs> <laughs> they don't have any more pizzas. Any. Oh, look, we have a light. This one is better. Yeah. Does it do white? Only red. Also the white, but. But only the red is working. Yeah, I think the battery is very low. All right. So we're walking on the the old old road into Igualada, we think, crosses underneath the new one and the old road feels very deserted this day. Maybe a bit too long hike, <laughs> maybe a bit too long hike today. It's all good, it's still kind of nice. It was just the first part, the stairs. <laughs> the first part, the stairs yes. at the start. It was the worst, the worst part of the day, and then it only got better from there. I would say the mountain goats were uh, quite the highlight of the day, and uh, crawling across waterfalls definitely got the heart going. Uh, yeah, the hike in the in the forest on the mountainside was super cool. Uh, now it's dark. Now it's dark. This this last part of the hike is. Uh, not the most amazing, just walking on old roads, next to roads, lots of asphalt. Getting back into civilization. And pizza. Well, talk to you later. So we have passed the uh, 25 kilometer mark. We're walking through this uh, inspiring industrial area. It's very, very straight. It's a straight road. And we have found a pizzeria that we are aiming for. And uh, we will be there in maybe 20 minutes or so. This was a very long day and those 20 minutes were the longest of the day until finally we made it to Igualada and to Pizza. This is the conclusion of our journey from Manresa to Igualada, traversing the majestic Montserrat and embracing every step. It's not just the distance covered that marks our adventure, but the memories forged, the challenges overcome, and the lessons learned along the way. We embark on this journey with nothing but excitement and a thirst for adventure, with no previous training or fancy gear. We think that the essence of adventure lies not in the perfection of your preparation, but in the spirit you bring to the journey. We are very proud of what we achieve. Day after day, we we were tested, we pushed through fatigue and blisters. It was also a journey of profound beauty and discovery. From the Santa Maria of Montserrat Monastery to the unexpected wildlife. Thank you for joining us on this incredible journey. We have more adventures to share with you. If you enjoy watching us, please subscribe, share your thoughts and questions, and share this with your friends and family. Until our next adventure, keep exploring, and as always, buen camino. Don't live without hitting that like button.